Hey guys, my name is Prem and in this video we are going to design the section of the website. Let's get started. Let's create a frame and uh, give this a resolution of 90, 20 and 1080. Uh, so let's just name this as header and and now we now we need to give this a fill so i will give this this yellow color and uh, now let's create a nav first nav bar first so in order to create a nav bar we'll need a logo so here is the logo that i will be using so let's create a frame now and uh, let's give this a solid black color and uh, put this logo in inside this frame let's name this as navbar all right so uh, let's now uh, create the menu icon menu section and now we need a few links uh, maybe I'll put a uh, foam and uh, now I will resize this a bit I'll do it uh, somewhere around 20 let's see how it looks I think I should increase the size to somewhere 24 yes 24 seems to be good so I will also uh, change the font I think it, it was decent so I will make this a auto and auto layout first so this would be menu link uh, now I will duplicate this one and uh, I will make both of them into an auto layout alright so let's change this into services And now it will be works and then it will be pricing and then it will be clients now let's increase the spacing to uh, 12 now let's get get this uh, in a CTA button so let's let's create a button for now let's right get started and now make this an auto layout and give this the same yellow color fill and convert this into white and center this let's give this a padding this will be 26 all right sorry this would be 26 and this will be 22 now we will uh, select this new nav bar frame and uh, press shift it to make this an auto layout and uh, now we will convert this into space between and uh, so before that let's take our let's take the help of this um, grid system and uh, choose 12 column this would be 90 margin and uh,
I think it should be 30. So now we will make this a little bit round. I think 22 is great. I will also make this one round. I think this is good. All right. So now let's create the hero section of it. So now let's choose a frame again and put this here. And now we will add a add a text here. So this will be this one. Now we have to change it to this. Let's give this a uh, stand space enter and. Uh, you can design this however you want Now I want this CTA button to be here also so I will also rename this as CTA and uh, now I will get this CTA button here I will select these two and uh, make this a group and select all these and make this a group again I think this would be the correct position for this. For that, I will also have to adjust padding of this. So I will rename this as left content. And this says text content and the CT is here. Alright, so let's do the main thing that is to animate it. So let's do that first. Uh, for that, we will need some shapes. Uh, let's hide the sky now. For that we'll need some shapes so what we'll do is that I uh, will create a few shapes here so maybe like this so this is the shape that I was talking about uh, what we'll do is that we'll create a frame out of this. This would be Control Alt G to create a frame. So this would be shapes. Now we will get this shape. Uh, instead of getting the shape first, so let's 
fill all the shapes with the images uh, so let's open our plugin called unsplash you can use any plugin to get images i need images related to, related to technology all right so i have these images with me so let's get this shape out of this and now let's duplicate this frame three four times so now what we'll do is that we will now this would be our first so we need to we don't need to do anything with this let's select this one and do changes with it all right so i have these four, four uh, changes with it so i will select all of these and go to this and create multi create components and set out of this so i will change default to one and this to two and this to three this to four so i have four variants now and one component so now let's create a prototype out of all of this and uh, select after delay of uh, one second if not first one second this would be uh, 400 millisecond after 400 milliseconds smart animate and uh, this will run for 400 milliseconds now we have 800 one milliseconds so now let's select 800 sorry it is 801 milliseconds and this is 400 so now we have uh, 1200 from this is 201 milliseconds and now we will look back to the first one this would be uh, 1600 1602 milliseconds let me check that again this was 448 this was uh, this was this would be 1201 this would be uh, 1602 I will need 1602 yes this is correct now okay everything is correct now what we'll do is that we will uh, remove this shape and get an instance out of this now we will play this so this is how any anim the animation is looking and I think it's really it's really great and uh, now let's see what we can do is the what we can do in this uh, let's give this a uh, drop shadow so that it will look a bit nicer let's choose this yellow color and give this a 50 percent opacity I think I should reduce the size of this menu links a little bit so let's press K and decrease the size yes now it is good and let me show you that how you can make this scalable 
because as you can see that if we will if you will do this now so it is not uh, an scalable scalable thing so now let's control and let's press con uh, shift a so that it is an auto layout now so Now we also need to press shift A on this header. Yes, after few changes, now we have a scalable uh, design. As you can see that if I will even scale this to something like this, the design is working great. I don't know why the animation is not working. Let me open this again. Yes, now it is working. Maybe I am having any issues with the cache and all. So don't need to worry, it will work on the system very good. So I hope this video was good and it was helpful to you and if you did like this please give this a thumbs up so that I can make similar videos for you guys. So thank you for watching this video and if you need this file so you can get that from the link in the description below. Uh, thank you for watching. Bye bye.